Hi Dinosaur and Kaiju fans, this is Ian Fairley, and today we are going to review the best dinosaur movie from 2010, known as You Are Uma Sao, aka Heart and Yummy, which is also the most emotional dinosaur movie next to The Land Before Time, Speckles to Tarbosaurus, Disney's Dinosaur, and of course, Dino King Journey to Fire Mountain. The story in this movie focuses on a young Tyrannosaurus named Hart, who was accidentally raised as a plant eater to his adoptive Myasaur mother and his adoptive Myasaur brother named Light. As a young dinosaur, Hart's life wasn't very easy from the start. He never knew what made him so different from the other dinosaurs, but it had to do something with being a big job, but Hart never knew it yet. One day, Hart was running through the forest to find out what he actually is and what he actually eats. But when he got to a desert, he saw a pack of T-Rexes just like him taking down a purple Triceratops. But the hunt was suddenly ended by the largest of the pack. This antagonist of the movie resembles one eye from Speckles to Tarbosaurus because his eye was scratched off by other dinosaurs. Regardless, he was tough. As I trotted along behind this mutilated Quasimodo, I wondered who or what he'd fallen victim to. His eye was gouged, and yet he carried himself with dignity, as though he had no more than a slight cold. <laughs> The other antagonist in the movie was Gonza, a curious Tyrannosaur who ran after Hart, only to see Light with him. He's more like the supporting antagonist who almost ate Light. Hart tried to save his brother, but when he did... <laughs> That's when he found out what he really was and what he ate. So in order to protect his family, Hart ran away from home. Oh man, poor kid. And then when he grew up, he stumbled upon a tiny egg, which contained an infant ankylosaurus named Yummy, or Umasao. <laughs> Just like that, Hart became an adoptive father. But enough about the story unless you want to see the full movie. I recommend it to anybody. Let's just get into the characters. Light was a Mayasaur who cared for Hart, even though Hart ran away. They both liked to eat fruits together, and their mother would always feed them fruits in case they were hungry. Regardless of his runaway, Hart still liked berries. Yummy, in my opinion, is the cutest dinosaur character since Bumpy from Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous and Earl from Disney Dinosaur. He's also a brave dinosaur thanks to Hart. However, he still needed protection. He's a little guy who could get eaten or hurt by other dinosaurs. Overall, this is one of the greatest dinosaur movies from 2010. I recommend this to any dinosaur fan who loves dinosaurs. This movie creates so much more emotion than Walking with Dinosaurs 2013. I was really hoping for an English dub of this, but it's probably not going to come. But we all hope for a live action version of this as well. If we had a live action version of this movie, it would be awesome and breathtaking as the original. It's almost like wishing for the live action version of The Land Before Time. I haven't done any more reviews since my last one on February with the crappy 1998 Godzilla movie. And in case I forgot, the Godzilla 1998 movie gets a D and goes into my seal of bullcrap. Where this movie gets an A plus and goes into my seal of approval as one of the greatest dinosaur films in history. This is Ian Fairley. I hope you all enjoyed this review. I'll see you in the next video. And remember, stay safe 
and stay healthy. And remember, sometimes you gotta risk it for the biscuit. Peace. All right, now you need to keep away from the copyright infringement. Shut up, me. And whatever, might I quit? <laughs>